Hello, welcome back to another episode of Saints Row 4, Enter the Dominatrix DLC. Let's hit this up and see what the next mission is. So you've rescued your friends. What comes next? A lot of bullshit filler missions. I think there must have been like four escort missions in a row. <laughs> it was so bad. Take Pierce to Terminal A. Protect Kinsey while she does nebulous task X. Guard Shandi while she drives to the widget factory? Uh, <laughs> that was the worst. That widget factory mission was fucking painful to sit through. Worse than that Nightblade reboot. So anyway, we jump through an arbitrary number of hoops trying to track down this dominatrix, and lo and behold, we find her. In a sex club, how shocking. That was our idea. <laughs> Have to do those arbitrary and You said I had to wear this outfit to to blend in. How come you're not in these kinky duds? Please, they know me here. So how do we get the dominatrix? Her champion Dom is at his throne. Talk to him. <laughs> is his last name Inata? Yeah. You make that sound weird. Oh yeah, yeah. I'm the one making this weird. That's a chair made of penises, that is. Hey, your leatheriness, I have a question for you. The Dom recognizes the smartly dressed newcomer. Uh, yeah. Look, I need to see the dominatrix. How do I make that happen? If you wish to see the dominatrix, you must prove your worth. Tend to my animals. You what now? The Dom's plushly adorned submissives. Put them back in their cages. Yeah, sure. You got it. Let's get this party started. Collect furry. Oh. Over here, fuzzy britches! <laughs> there you go! I'm on you, furry! And the crowd goes wild! Come here now, get over here. This is surprisingly fun throwing furries in the cage. Get in that way, you! I'm gonna get you now! You said I had to wear this outfit to... To blend in? How come you're not in these kinky duds? Please, they know me here. So how do we get the dominatrix? Her champion, Dom, is at his throne. Talk to him. <laughs> is his last name Inata? Yeah. You make that sound weird. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm the one making this weird. That's a chair made of penises, that is. Hey, your leatheriness. I have a question for you. The Dom recognizes the smartly dressed newcomer. Uh, yeah. Look, I need to see the dominatrix. How do I make that happen? If you wish to see the dominatrix, you must prove your worth. Tend to my animals. You what now? The Dom's plushly adorned submissives. Put them back in their cages. Yeah, sure. You got it. Let's get this party started. Over here, fuzzy britches! There you go! I'm on you, furry! And the crowd goes wild! Come here now, get over here! Get in that crate, you! I'm gonna get you now! Get back in your kennel! <sighs> Have I mentioned how glad I am I am not in this mission? <laughs> you 
Where are you going, huh? Let me stay. Good boy. Come on, get over it, Murray. That's the lot. I'll put your pets away. Now, where's that dominatrix? Not yet. You must now prove your willingness to please. Ah, piss on it. That's up to the client. You'll find him on the second floor. Make sure he is pleased. It's just a simulation. <laughs> This isn't real. It's just a simulation. Welcome to the Pleasure Dome. Population, you. <laughs> Somebody order an English breakfast? Just open the door. Hold oh, no! on! I'm getting oh, ready for yes. you, baby. Zemos? Oh, shit! I didn't know you work here. I'm just a temp. I mean, I don't. But if you haven't gone pro, then why are you here? I need to speak with a dominatrix. Dom to Dom told me I... That, but no! No way! I mean, ugh, no offense. It'd be like fucking my cousin. <laughs> Look. I say you did a good job. Just don't tell anybody you saw me paying for ass. Oh my god! I wondered why Zemos and the boss couldn't look each other in the eye after this. What the? Oh god. That's creepy. <laughs> Your client has been serviced. Back so soon. I hope you got your money's worth, Zemos. Oh, yeah. I really like the way they use their pinky. The Dominatrix only meets with champions. A chariot race is starting <laughs> soon, and it's attracted the best racers in the world. Take out your competition and come talk to me. Finally, back to the killing. What am I doing here? I feel so alone. new batteries feeling frisky huh the race it puts the lotion on its skin or else it gets the hose again that's creepy Competition is done for. Now let's talk about this race. <laughs> oh, you fool! Those amateurs never stood a chance. You want to win the race? You'll need to defeat the Dom. You right, arsehole. You fucking use me! You are a submissive. You are made to be used. <laughs> Come, my submissive. Tend to your Dom. I'll take out your entire damn club, mate! Bad 
your subs to do your dirty work, eh, Tom? Before I am through, you'll be begging for your life. You've obviously never met a saint. You may have defeated me, but you still have to win the race if you want to see the dominatrix. Seamos, to me! Man, this is bullshit! We ride! Invitational. And the racers are off! Wow, I never thought I'd be called upon to come and take a pony car. <laughs> Me neither, Bobby. In fact, I'm pretty sure this is against my contract. We have an exciting race ahead of us. Well, you might Every almost say it's going to be titillating, Holy Bobby. Crap. This is awesome. Oh, there goes a welcome to the 31st annual Pony Cart Invitational. Brought to you today by Leather and Lace. And speaking of Leather and Lace, they provided the head of the Saints and his pony with their outfits today. And what? Fine apparel that is, Zach. I have to say, though, I wish I had the figure to pull something like that off. Yeah, I hear you, Zach, but as good as it may look, I can't imagine that's very comfortable. Oh, indeed. I hate to think how bad that must chafe after a long day at the track. Yeah, myself, I prefer the soothing touch of a poly cotton blend. Well, I've always been more of a satin man, Bobby. The way the fine weave caresses my skin is pure magic. I... Rusty's new trombone has some heat! And another one bites the dust! More contestants have entered the track! And we got more ponies oh on the field! Down. A tragic end for Rusty's new trombone! One less racer on Lock the field! Up. Another racer eliminated! And here comes Hot Carlos with his steed, Nicky the Nag. <laughs> Send that one to Hot Carlos has been blown away. Oh, come on. There we go. Goodbye, Miss Chivia Skip. Will be missed. Nice. Is this not our turn? And we have a winner. A great showing by the head of the Saints and his Tony Zemo. Yes, indeed. And that horse has definitely earned an extra carrot today. <laughs> So, you rescued Zemos. What's next? The Dominatrix orders Paul to terrorize the city, and we need to figure out a way to stop it. It was our darkest hour, and despair was filling the saints. But Donnie came forward with a plan to save us all. Let's not oversell it. He had us build a spaceship. As a team, Kinsey. As a team. You guys are at least showing the seven-minute QTE montage of us building the ship to fight Paul, right? Oh, come on. What? That would have been awesome. Jesus! I didn't think getting a giant monster to eat us was going to be so difficult. I warned you Paul was dangerous. <sighs> when I heard Giant Saints flow can, I really didn't expect oh. it to be that tough. Sorry I never took you seriously, Pierce. Kinsey, where to? To Paul's brain. 
That's where our weapons will do the most damage. Hold on. This thing has a brain. What exactly have I been drinking all of these years? <laughs> I'm contractually prevented from divulging the secret ingredients in Saint's Flow. It doesn't matter as long as we get up there and stop Paul. Just focus on that. The city looks nice up here. I always wondered what my food saw when I ate. <laughs> and people say I'm weird. say what those things floating inside Paul were? I don't remember that coming up. Oh, there's supposed to be stuff like ginseng, guarana, terrine, all those types of ingredients you find in a regular energy drink. And what about those big polyp looking things? Ah, oh, those, uh, the, the, those are just, uh, stuff. Wait a minute. Didn't I see those before in a medical dissection video of a frog? Oh, look! We're almost to Paul's brain! <laughs> If we release our payload here, it should cause a chain reaction that'll destroy Paul. Then let's do it. How come nothing's happening? Ah, uh, the cargo hold's packed too tight. Um, try shaking the ship from side to side until they come loose. What'd you do, just stop everything in there, Pierce? You try getting all those things fizzle stones and videos away. We have to get out of here before the whole place blows. Then oh. how exactly do we do that? Head for Paul's top. Oh, good. At least the intense escape from Paul wasn't cut. the dominatrix. Do I have enough time for that? Ooh, that's worth a lot. Friend of the raptors? Yeah, I'm probably gonna end the episode here because that one's probably gonna take too long. So, if you like, subscribe. If you don't, don't. But I think next episode we'll hopefully finish off this DLC. So, hope you'll join me then. Let's take care.